Welcome to The Ellen DeGeneres Show, starring Sean Hayes. I've now, <laughs> I've now guest hosted five times, which means I now get my own parking spot, <laughs> as long as I pay the meter and move by six. I checked the Television Academy rules, and it also means that if The Ellen Show wins an Emmy Award this season, I'm entitled to part of it. So, yeah. That's true. They have to break off the top, and I keep the bottom. <laughs> Obviously, oh my god. <laughs> Obviously, Ellen isn't here today. Want to know why? Yeah, I'm so glad you said that. Get this. It's because she's contractually allowed to have guest hosts fill in for her. <laughs> Normally, I'd make a joke about how she's home counting her money, or she's getting a Brazilian butt lift, <laughs> or she's at Magic Mountain with her friends from Shutterfly. <laughs> but this is my fifth time, and I'm just going to be honest with you. No more games. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly, they keep asking me back because I kill it every time, like that last joke. <laughs> Awfully nice of you. And when you've hosted as much as I have, you learn a few things about the show. For instance, did you know that Ellen's producer, Mary, never goes home? Yeah, they just, they just pack her away in a broom closet at the end of the day. <laughs> yeah. She's a lesbian. <laughs> and since I'm now a guest hosting expert, I thought I'd take some time to review Ellen's other guest hosts and dish out a little advice. My first tip is never underestimate yourself. Look what happened when Ellie Kemper guest hosted. Here is how this game works. All you have to do is roll this ball into that hole. And if you do, you will win a prize. So does that seem easy? Sounds real. I'm gonna take care of it. All right, oh! <laughs> I want your confidence. I, I will show you how easy it is, okay? okay. <laughs> I, I'm gonna demonstrate first to show you how easy it is. Yeah, I love her, I love that. I think Ellie won $10,000, <laughs> which means she made more for that one show than I've made for all five of mine. <laughs> My second tip is to play your strengths. Josh Gad was here. He's a Broadway performer like myself. Here's how he opened the show. Show like the Ellen Show. No place that I'd rather go. We're gonna laugh and dance and have a little fun today. Today, there's no place that I'd rather be. We're one big happy family. I know everyone's name. Isn't that right, Ricky? It's Dave. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he did great. It was, uh... yeah, it, it was brilliant. He gave it his all and he nailed it, but he forgot Dave's name, which is an amateur mistake. Dave and I go way back. Isn't that right, Dave? I'm Paul. That's Dave. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you. <laughs> Finally, and this is important, you have to assert dominance over your guests. Make it clear that you are the alpha, or they will walk all over you. Look what happened when Twitch guest hosted and welcomed a little girl named Zaza. Yeah. <laughs> all right. All right. <laughs> the rest of that show was hosted by Zaza. <laughs>